Okay, here's a Model 2MG project. I've had these before. I had one up and running and got rid of it over time. Always wanted another one. They're nothing special. They're just a cool old saw. I think they're 100 plus cc. I'll have to check it out and get back to you on that one. Anyway, um, I know there's no spark because the plug wire is completely cut off on the other side. So I'm going to take this bar off so I can turn it around and get at it and we'll pull the recoil off and get in and have a look at it. As soon as I get the bar off and get it pulled apart a bit, I'll get back to you. Okay, so there's five screws around the outer perimeter to get to the flywheel. You gotta loosen this handle off as it turns out. Because part of the recoil is in under here. Underneath that handle you can see it better that way. So this looks like every other typical model. Looks like you'd loosen this off leave these on and it'll work like a flywheel puller and just pull the flywheel off. So I'm going to get my little um, impact gun. Just one second, I'll turn you back on. Okay, so I've got this little butterfly gun. It's great for small engines. I'm going to put her on. There you go. Nothing like a built-in puller on it. Okay. I see the first problem. Coils cracked. Uh, and here's the spark plug wire. We're definitely not going to get any spark from that. I've got a part saw. Sometimes you can glue these up like I've showed you before with an epoxy. I'm going to open the other one up and see what it looks like. If it's no better, we'll try gluing this one. Anyway, I'll get back to you on that, alright? Okay, I finally got another coil in it. This here coil, you can see, has been cracked and epoxied as well. Um, the part saw that I've been using, the coil is no good in that, the coil is no good in this. I got it from a uh, Remington Bantam, or sorry, a Remington SL5 that's more or less just a part saw. It's pretty busted up, so it's donated a coil. You can't get these coils, and it doesn't seem to matter what type of maul you have, whether it be a 2MG, an OMG, a 12, no, not a 12, and any of the Remington models of these, all the coils seem to crack. Anyway, I've got to put the flywheel back on. I've checked it. I've got sparks. Put the flywheel back on. Put the recoil on. Might pop the bottom off the float bowl or I might just put some fuel in and see if it'll fire up without cleaning the curb. When I get to that point, I'll get back to you. Alright, so i got everything all back together. I wound up taking the bottom off the curb. There's just a bit of dry powder that I blew at the gas tank. There's some dry powder like from the gas drying up over the years. Barring chains on it. Throttle linkage is giving me a bit of grief. The on off switch is working now. Uh, anyway, she's all back together. It's got spark, got gas. So, next time we turn the camera on, uh, after this video, this will be video one. Video two of it will be up and running. Alright. So, thanks for subscribing. Thanks for watching. Thanks for commenting. Thanks for giving a thumbs up. It really does help it grow. You know, if you take the time to watch it, just take 30 seconds, please, and give it a thumbs up, even if you don't want to say ink. Anyway, just kidding. Let's fire her up.
enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Mall2MG.